You know, there are two for sure things that happen to each one of us in this life. Each of us are born, and each of us will die. Now, nobody knows for sure what happens after death, although mankind has speculated about it since the beginning of mankind. What's next? Do you think it's possible to communicate from beyond the grave with the living? Many people have stories about receiving messages, one final message from a loved one from beyond the grave. In fact, it's a fairly common tale of what most people would say is the impossible, yet perfectly sane and ordinary people seem to experience this phenomenon. Did you know that even pro wrestling legend Hulk Hogan has a story of receiving a message from a loved one from beyond the grave? That's right, wrestling superstar Hulk Hogan received a phone call from fellow wrestling legend and friend Rowdy Roddy Piper. 12 hours after Piper had passed away. And the best part is, Roddy Piper left Hogan a voicemail, so the claim is actually proven. Could Roddy Piper have really died and somehow managed to place a last heavenly phone call to his beloved friend? Now, Hulk Hogan seems to have chalked the whole thing up to a glitch in his cell phone. Not very Christian-like for a man who told us to take our vitamins and say our prayers our whole lives. I'd think Hogan would see a miracle before him, especially when you hear what Mr. Roddy Piper has to say to his friend. Let's take a look. You know, the news came that he passed away, you know. And I felt like I got shot in the chest with a cannon, you know. And it kind of like knocked me off track for a couple of days. And uh, then all of a sudden I get this voice message. It was really weird because either my phone was messed up, sometimes you'll get a text message at that night when it was sent to you in the morning. somebody after they passed away and for especially for him to say I'm loving you and walking with Jesus my brother just loving you and walking with Jesus I was like wow totally screwed me up hmm old Hollywood Hogan there seems a little confused on his Bible knowledge now I'm not sure what aliens or close encounters have to do with his friend passing away and then 12 hours later alerting him that he is walking with Jesus but hey Hogan's been hit in the head by a lot of steel chairs. I don't believe in coincidence. Everything happens for a reason. Even if by some astronomical chance this was a delayed glitch in the voicemail system of Hogan's phone, Hogan received that message when he was meant to. And I think his friend was saying a pleasant goodbye in his own way. I'm curious what you guys think about this one. Let me know in the comments. Do you believe that Roddy Piper made a mystical final phone call to his beloved friend? Or do you believe this is a uniquely strange coincidence? Let me know. Also, be sure to give us a follow. Quick Note Conspiracies is now on TikTok, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and Twitter. Until next time, truth seekers, be well. And just maybe, say a prayer. Take a vitamin once in a while. Hey, it can't hurt.